Does this chair covered in clothes look familiar? Most people have one of these in their bedroom, so don't act like you don't have one. I'm Nonis with Get Organized Already. Today, I'm in my bedroom to talk about what to do with your chair drove. When you're taking a look at your chair, there are a bunch of different categories here. So I'm gonna start with my favorite category and the one that's the biggest culprit on the chair and that are clothes that aren't clean and they aren't dirty. I call them clirty. This would be a perfect example. I wore this sweater the other day, it was freezing cold, it didn't get dirty, and so I can totally wear this again. For hanging clothes, I have a spot in my closet for the clirty ones to the left of all my clean stuff. I have the empty hangers to kind of delineate, and then I have the clirty clothes on the far left. Same goes for drawers. If I have a t-shirt or something that I only wore for a minute, I just kind of lay it in top, on top of my other t-shirt. The second idea for things to do with clirty clothes is get little hooks, like a command hook maybe, but you can put them in your closet in a specific spot, maybe on the back of the door, maybe just inside the door frame. I like to keep them in my closet instead of somewhere else because that's where I go to get dressed, to look for stuff to wear. The second item that are here are just dirty clothes. You can just throw those in the dirty clothes at night when I'm getting undressed too, because I'm taking off clothes, putting them in the dirty clothes, deciding whether they're clean or dirty. I can take anything that's dirty on the chair, put it in the hamper, or anything that's clean. That's the third category of stuff that's here. Like you tried it on and then decided not to wear that. You can do that at night when you're getting undressed. Hang them up, put them back where they were. Or another trick I like to do with the clean clothes that are here. Whenever I do laundry, I just look at the chair and put the clean stuff right on top. Keeps the energy going. You know, you're, I'm sitting down to fold the laundry anyway, so I'll just fold the stuff that's on the chair. The fourth category are clothes that need mending or fixing. They need a button or something. So I just grab my sewing kit out of the closet. Ask yourself, where is this gonna be mended? At the dry cleaner or tailor? Then I'm gonna put it with my dry cleaning or if it's just a little fix that you're gonna do, take your sewing kit and the piece of clothing and set it wherever you are gonna do the repair. Maybe it's in your bed. And yes, this is gonna look ugly sitting on my end table or on my couch, but that's gonna remind me to do it. There's, a, there's one more issue that we have not discussed about the chair drove. I know I've said this before many times and I'm gonna say it again. Don't beat yourself up. If you have a chair drove, so what? So do I, and I'm on top of it. But we still get a chair drove, right, at my house. So you can take care of it every day, like I said, when you're getting undressed, or you can take care of it when you do your laundry. You can delegate it to someone else to take care of. Maybe somebody in your family likes to do laundry. Have them do it for their chore. Another great idea that I like, that I saw at a um, rental house we were staying at one time, is to install some heavy duty hooks. You can use that in your bedroom or your closet or your bathroom to hang the clothes that you wear a lot of the time. Even if they're fresh out of the laundry, you know, just hang them there instead of folding or putting them on a quilt. It could work. I have these hangers right by my front door. This is the kind of thing I'm talking about. Something sturdy that you can hang a lot of clothes. Now you can go handle your chair full of clothes because chairs in the bedroom, let's face it, they're made for sexier things than clothes. Yes, I'm talking about Rudy. Thank you for subscribing and please sign up for our newsletter and get tips right in your mailbox. The link is in the description for you to get organized already.